The power companies, they could take the power companies, the railways back. I mean, the power companies are vi a natural monopoly. You know, they're necessary to the infrastructure of the country. It's natural that they would be in the public sector. That's not a controversial or radical thing to say. That would have been a given at one time. You know, and Labour's just saying, oh, we'll cap all the prices. And the Tories are saying, no need to do that. Just switch. Spend your evening switching, choosing between. Yes, come on, it'll be a fun game for the whole country. Like when we used to play Scrabble. And you think, oh, fucking hell. My life's nearly over. I don't have time to fanny around comparing tariffs and prices. There are things I've yet to achieve in my life. I still can't speak a foreign language with any proficiency. I've never read Moby Dick and I've never been to India. I don't want to spend my few good years scuttling among service providers like an apprentice who's been sent out for a tin of striped paint. And there's nothing to choose anyway. They're a cartel. They're a, it's not, you know, you're not, you're just stuck between different gas and electricity companies. It's not a smorgasbord of choice online. It's not like Match.com, except to the extent that you waste all of your free time interacting with liars and arseholes until you're so worn down by their bullshit, you end up getting fucked by one of them. <laughs>